hello in this video i am going to show you how you can display record in user side i will explain you which type of record we want we want this type of layout you can see here this type of record layout in our project so first of all in user side we need to create one page so i am going to add new item one web form web form name is display underscore item select master page and add we need to select here user user master and ok now here we need repeater id d1 and run at server ok now we need to do code in c sharp page so right click here or in i will show you right click here and go in view code now here we need to add to library and now here we need connection string so i will copy this connection string from copy and paste over here now connection open connection close sql command cmd is equal to cun dot create command cmd dot command type is equal to command type dot text cmd dot command text is equal to here we have to write select query select star from we need to pass here our database table name so first we will check our table name our table name is product then also we will check yes our table name is product so i am going to write here product cmd dot execute non query now data table dt is equal to new data table sql data adapter da is equal to new sql data adapter cmd da dot fill dt now d1 dot data source this is the name of our repeater is equal to dt and d1 dot data bind okay now we need this design so for this design this template if you want this template then please send me email so i will send you this uh, template in your mail and also if you need the code of this asp.net project then also send me email i will send you by mail okay now for this i am going to open this in this code i, I have to wait to check this copy this and paste here so i am going to paste here we need to take here item template now paste over here complete this ul over here now we need here header template also so i am going to take here header template and here we need one footer template so i am going to take this footer template now this ul cut this ul and paste over here and cut this less ul and paste over here okay now just i am going to run this page set a startup page and we are going to check what happened when we run first time it will take some time so we have to wait yes you can see we get here data but we don't want this data we want data from our database our table so we need to change minor thing so first of all 
here we have to give our database column name so we have to write like this less than percentage as well and we have to provide here first of all i have to stop this and we need to check this our column name our column name is product underscore images so we need to write here product underscore images and our folder images folder is outside of this user folder here so we need to pass here one dot dot slash dot dot slash means one side back now here we need to pass our product title so i am going to pass here product name now this is for product description so i am going to pass here product description and here we need to pass product price and we don't have this type of women's men's category right now so we can write like this here product underscore qty available quantity and this for price now i am going to run this so we can check we get our record or not over there we can see we get our record my image are too big so we can see the part of that image but this is perfect so if you uh, add two or three or four images then you will get this type of images over here and now everything is okay so this way we can display your record dynamically using repeater in asp.net project thank you so much for watching my video